Hey guys, it's Vlogman101, and I know what you're thinking. It's been a while, okay? And that's just due to... We've been kind of busy. But I need to put more effort into my YouTube channel so that it actually goes somewhere. Because I don't think most people want me to go like eight or nine days without a video. See, the first couple of days I did really well and I had a video like every day, sometimes even twice or three times a day. But now it's just been a while. Happy uh, late 4th to everybody and I hope you had a good one. I definitely did. I went to uh, a pool party with my friend. And we were there for like six hours. And then afterwards, we went to another friend's house and we watched fireworks. And we also played Uno for an hour and a half. Because they, their Uno has um, draw 10 and draw 15 cards, which makes for a really long game. But it was fun. And we're gonna, I'm gonna go back over there at some point today or tomorrow or something. So we'll see what happens. Well, since the last video, not much has really happened other than I, I have myself a new job. So, um, it didn't work out at Speedway. And here's why. Because I was, apparently according to my boss, people said I was slow on the register. Even though I was going as fast as I possibly could. So I don't, I don't get that. But it happens, I guess. And. Honestly, most people agree with me that. The two weeks I was there is not enough time to learn everything and be perfect at your work. So some, most people think I should have been given more chances, but that just didn't work out. But on the plus side, I work in the, the Bojangles now in the same store. How about that? So I still get to see my friends that I like from my work. So that's cool. But for the past uh, couple days, I just haven't been feeling too well. I think I finally figured out what the problem was. You know there's like flavored ice pops you get for uh, summertime? Well, I was eating a bunch of those every day. And apparently that's not good for you. Who knew? They're like... 35 calories for two of them, but I guess the dye in them is just not good for you, so I haven't been eating them. But I do love them, and I will still eat them, even if it causes me grief. I like to let them melt, and so I just drink the dye. It's not healthy for you, but whatever. There's worse stuff out there for you. So, all of our animals are doing well. The puppy's doing well. The cats, the cat, I mean, is doing well. All of our chickens seem to be doing well. So, everything's just going well at this point, which is great. Because there was points in time not too long ago where we were just losing birds left and right. Because either animals were taking them or they were just dying for whatever reason. Like, the last bird we lost was Tailless, and she was the the mama hen who uh, a coyote grabbed onto and ripped off her tail. And her babies are right there. It's sad that Tailless is gone because she was a, a great mother, but it just happens. If any, if any animal doesn't care if it was a chicken, 
or even another baby just like them. They got too close to her babies. She was going to let them know. Hi, pretty girl. Hi. You need a name. Y'all got any names? She needs a name. She's such a sweet little bird. Oh. I don't know where she is, but I have a, a speckled Sussex, which is my favorite breed. I just love them. And she's so sweet. She's the sweetest chicken I've ever had. And I love her. Her name is BB. I come outside and I just call all the chickens BB. But I named her Beatrice and call her BB for short. Don't know where she is though. These little babies I got a couple weeks ago. They're doing well. None of them... Surprisingly, of all 12 that I got, none of them died. Yet. <laughs> They're looking at me like I just stole their lunch or something. Chill out. But, like I said, the chickens are doing well. Which is great. Little chicken right there. That's the youngest bird on the farm. They're probably four weeks now. And they're all doing really well. Which I'm so happy about. Here's another little Sussex. Hi, baby. But that's not BB. BB! I see her. I see my BB. BB! BB, that's BB. You gonna? Oh well, okay then. I took a step towards you. Goodness. Are you gonna come back? <laughs> She's not gonna come back. And then we have all kinds of different sized chickens around here. They, that naked neck chicken all the way over there is huge. A lot bigger than this one. That's right there. Baby, come back here. Love me. She's usually not this, uh, finicky. But whenever I catch her, she lets me hold her and she'll fall asleep in my arms. It's cute. And then Americana and, uh, um... Production red, that's what that is. BB, come here. Love me. I don't think she likes the camera. She's camera shy. Uh. So, I'm happy because we went to, um, a place in a town called Rocky Mount, where somewhere where we live, and they have a, a like a Italian Egyptian place called Hemos, and it's really good. We went there today with some good friends of ours, and it had some of the best chicken alfredo I've ever had. Baby, don't run away. I'm coming. I'm coming for you. Come here, you stupid chicken. I love you, BB. She does like me, but she just doesn't like me right now, apparently. There's another Sussex. I've got four. Four Sussexes. One big one and a Three babies. This will get BB over here. Here she comes. 
You're so cute. And one more scoop. And a scoop for the goats and the geese and whatnot. Hey, BB. Bye. Bye. Watch. The chickens are going to come running. Well, come on. Here comes some of them. But I guess this is the majority of them. There's a couple still over there. But whatever. I got food dust all over my phone. But anyway. I think that will just about do it for this video. I'll try my best to do more every day. And upload daily. I promise. Y'all have a good rest of your week, and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.